Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Crime Talk, where we embark on a journey through history's darkest moments. Today, we delve deep into the enigmatic story of Adolf Hitler and his final hours, which marked the tragic conclusion of his tyrannical reign. Adolf Hitler was born in Brno, Austria, Hungary, and spent his formative years near Linz. His early life in Vienna during the early 1900s eventually led him to Germany in 1913. It was in the midst of chaos and the Russian army's encroachment on Berlin that he married his longtime girlfriend in a chaotic ceremony officiated by a priest. Following their wedding, events in Hitler's life unfolded with remarkable speed. It was a time when Germany was reeling from the aftermath of World War I, a global conflict that had left the nation defeated and burdened with sanctions, economic restrictions, and immense losses. Unemployment and starvation were rampant, and the ruling elite seemed more concerned with their own glory than the welfare of the people. The disillusionment and discontent among the German populace provided fertile ground for Hitler, a former soldier from World War I, to establish his own political party, the National Socialist German Workers' Party, and STAB, commonly known as the Nazi Party. This far-right party, active from 1920 to 1945, championed the ideology of Nazism. The Nazi Party, under Adolf Hitler's leadership, would go on to leave an indelible mark on history. Despite initial electoral setbacks, Hitler's ambitions within the party grew exponentially. The Nazi ideology centered on the belief in the superiority of the German people and their entitlement to global dominance, fueling Hitler's insatiable desire to expand beyond Germany's borders. Blaming the Jewish population for Germany's defeat in World War I, Hitler capitalized on this sentiment and turned it into a political weapon. In 1933, he began acting on these anti-Semitic ideas, marking the beginning of a dark chapter in history. Hitler's rise to power was marked by the dissolution of all parliamentary institutions, granting him absolute authority. His reign was characterized by a deep-seated hatred for Jews, culminating in the expulsion and, ultimately, the genocide of millions of Jews a chapter that remains one of the darkest in human history. Hitler's ambitions extended beyond Germany's borders. He sought control of Poland and other countries, leading to the outbreak of World War I. Germany found itself allied with Italy, under the leadership of Benito Mussolini, who had become Prime Minister of Italy in 1922, and Japan. Together, they formed a formidable coalition known as the Axis Powers. Each of these nations harbored its own territorial ambitions, causing widespread concern among other nations. As news of Hitler's expansionist plan spread, Europe and other countries began to fortify their defenses, fearing an imminent attack. The stage was set for world war, i.e. a conflict that would reshape the world. Europe found itself divided with Italy, Germany, and Japan forming one bloc, while France, England, the United States, and the Soviet Union formed another. The fear of Hitler and Mussolini's ambitions united these nations, creating a world starkly divided. The outbreak of World War I, I was triggered on September 1, 1939, when Germany launched a brutal attack on Poland. Britain, having promised to support Poland, declared war on Germany, and France followed suit. While Poland fell quickly to German forces, the war was far from over. Hitler, emboldened by his conquest of France, turned his sights towards England, hoping to achieve further dominance. The German Air Force initiated a ruthless bombing campaign, aiming to cripple England. However, England's resilience and determination proved unmatched. They stood firm against the German onslaught, thwarting Hitler's dreams of conquering the British Isles. This marked the first significant dent in Hitler armor a moment when his leadership was questioned. With the situation in England growing increasingly difficult, Hitler shifted his focus to the Soviet Union, driven by his intense loathing of communism. Little did he know that his ultimate challenge 
was just beginning. While initial Nazi victories in the Soviet Union seemed promising, the Russian army regrouped and mounted a fierce resistance, encircling and defeating Hitler's forces before they could capture Moscow. This failure, coupled with the inability to subdue England, weakened not only Hitler's military position, but also his political standing. World War, I had a profound impact on Germany, laying the groundwork for future conflicts. As Italy surrendered in World War I, Hitler's power and influence began to wane. Italy's surrender was a shock that reverberated through Hitler's regime, weakening his position. This surrender marked a turning point as it bolstered the strength of the Soviet army, which began advancing towards Germany. At the same time, the United States put pressure on Japan, another Axis power culminating in the devastating atomic bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki in August 1945. World War, I, I witnessed the first use of nuclear weapons and these bombings forced Japan into surrender, signaling a pivotal moment in the war. Meanwhile, as the Russian army closed in on Berlin, Hitler's dream of victory began to unravel. Realizing that his war resources were dwindling and that other nations were uniting against him, Hitler saw no way out. The nuclear bombings further shattered his resolve and his ultimate downfall was imminent. In Berlin, a fortified underground bunker had been constructed 50 feet below ground level. This bunker served as Hitler's last refuge from the advancing Russian army as he believed that the Russians would be defeated in Berlin allowing him to return to the battlefield. However, the situation in Berlin was rapidly deteriorating and the distance between Hitler and the Russian army was shrinking. In a cruel twist of fate, some of Hitler's senior army officials betrayed him, providing crucial information about his hideout to the enemy. This marked the beginning of the end of Hitler's reign, a reign marked by ruthless power and persecution. The Axis powers, Germany, Italy and Japan had shared ambitions of world domination, each with its own expansionist goals. However, their aggressive actions ultimately led to their downfall. As Berlin fell and rumors circulated about Hitler's fate, some claimed he had fled, while others believed he had died. In late April 1945, the Russian army was closing in on Hitler's bunker in Berlin, and the tension was palpable. Every step forward brought them closer to their target. The capture of Hitler's dentist by the Russian army added a new dimension to the mystery. They claimed to have found Hitler's tooth, providing undeniable proof of their proximity. Despite numerous tales of Hitler's survival, Russia's claim regarding the tooth remained steadfast. It became the most compelling piece of evidence, symbolizing the relentless advance of the Russian army. The dentist, who had been imprisoned for 13 years, eventually wrote a book titled The Memoirs of Hitler's Bodyguard, further fueling the speculation surrounding Hitler's fate. However, historians and experts generally agree that Hitler met his end in the bunker. As Berlin fell and Hitler's power crumbled, his mental state deteriorated rapidly. Facing impending capture, he made a fateful decision. He proposed to Eva Braun, his longtime companion, on April 29, 1945 amidst the ongoing Russian bombings in Berlin. Eva agreed to marry him, marking a surprising move considering the dire circumstances. In his final moments, Hitler made a series of eerie requests. He insisted that his body be burned and then buried. He ordered all his belongings to be brought to his room and incinerated, except for one painting, which he instructed his driver to take out of Berlin. He also made a chilling decision to test the effectiveness of kyanide by administering it to his beloved dog, confirming its potency. Then in the bleak confines of his bunker, Hitler and Eva, his wife of only a few hours, took their own lives. Eva bit into a kyanide capsule while Hitler shot himself with his pistol. This marked the end of Hitler's failed attempts at world domination and the conclusion of a reign marked by power, persecution, and unimaginable suffering the Axis power's aggressive strategies had massive global implications, triggering World War I and leading to immense loss of life and devastation. In the end, 
their grand plan for world domination crumbled, leaving a world forever scarred by the horrors of war. The legacy of World War I endures with the use of nuclear weapons marking a significant turning point in the conflict. While the bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki ended battles, they also ushered in new conflicts and fears, forever shaping the course of history. As we reflect on Hitler's life and the atrocities committed during his reign, we cannot forget the millions of lives lost, particularly among the Jewish population. Hitler's actions, including the mass murder of hundreds of thousands of Jews in Germany, played a pivotal role in the longing for a Jewish homeland. This desire ultimately led to the establishment of Israel in 1948. Today, Israel stands as a testament to the resilience and determination of a people who endured unspeakable horrors during World War I. The story of Hitler's rise to power, his reign, and his final moments serves as a stark reminder of the consequences of unchecked ambition and the devastating impact of war on humanity. It is a story that should never be forgotten, a cautionary tale for future generations.